What's up beauties? It's Brandy and I'm coming on today with a makeup look for you guys. Yesterday I posted a picture about this hair on my Instagram and I did the eye look because I feel like this hair is really glam and it's completely different from what I normally wear so I wanted to jazz it up a bit and I popped some color onto my eyes which I never do. I'm always like a neutral girl but I wanted to try out this um, eyeshadow palette that I picked up from Target. It is by e.l.f. and it's the their um baked eyeshadow palette and it has a lot of really really pretty colors in here a lot of purples and blues and all of them are really shimmery colors so I originally tried this and did not like it at all and I had it like pushed back to the bottom of my vanity drawer and I was basically gonna give it away or either throw it away but I thought why not give it a try again because the colors are really really pretty in it but they just weren't that pigmented oh, one tip that I did pick up is if you have an eyeshadow that isn't really pigmented as you thought it would be always add some type of finishing spray this is the dewy finish spray but I've also used fix plus I've used the elf makeup mist and set like any type of spray like that just to wet your eyeshadow brush and then dip it in the eyeshadow and it will have it look Looking super super pigmented. So before I get into the actual tutorial I'm sure some of you guys are probably wondering about my hair and this is a wig that I made from some hair that I received from her hair company. I have done a review here on my channel for their Brazilian straight hair. This is their Brazilian curly so I did film a first impression review of this hair so if you guys are interested in checking that out then I will leave the link in the description box below and you can check it out and see if you like it. So um, at this point I am going to just kick it to the tutorial so if you guys are interested in seeing how I got this eyeshadow look then please keep watching. Okay guys I'm going to start by priming my eyelid with my MAC Studio Finish Concealer in NW30 and just putting that all over the lid. Then I'm following up with my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the color black and putting that down and then blending that in with a brush that I have from e.l.f. This is just going to make the eyeshadow pop a little bit more and look even more pigmented and bright. And then next, picking up my Too Faced Chocolate Bar palette, I'm using the color Semi Sweet and I'm just popping that into my crease as a transition color for me just so all of the next colors that I use will blend really, really well. Okay, and before applying the shadow that is pretty much the start of this look, I'm just spraying my brush with a little bit of the NYX Dewy Finish Spray and then using the color that's second from the right in my e.l.f. Baked Eyeshadow Palette. It's kind of like a purplish blue color. And then I'm going back in and picking up the color Triple Fudge from the Chocolate Bar Palette and popping that into the outer corner of my eye and also my crease. And then just going back and forth between the smaller tapered brush and the blending brush just so the colors blend seamlessly. And because I didn't feel like the color on my lid was popping enough, I went back and added a little more of the color just to deepen it a little bit more. And then I'll be using the Ardell Natural Lashes and this is the these are the Demi Wispies. And I love these so much because they look so natural but they add just a little bit of flair as well. And I'm getting so much better at applying false lashes it's just crazy so I'm trying to make sure that they're as close to my lash line as possible okay and to brighten up underneath my brow bone I am popping in the Jaclyn Hill highlighter and champagne pop and then also applying that to the inner tear duct of my eyes just to brighten the look up a bit and open my eyes more and then underneath my lower lash line, I am including the baked eyeshadow color that I put on my lid and also including the triple fudge color just to deepen it a little bit more that I use from the chocolate bar palette. I'm going to also blend those colors together just so it looks a little bit smoky and not so, you know, dark and deep. Then I'm following up with my favorite mascara, which is the L'Oreal Telescopic. This is the Shocking Extensions and applying that heavily on my lower um, lashes and then just a little bit on the top lashes to blend my lashes with the falsies. Now at this point I have already done my foundation and a lot of other stuff on my face but I went ahead and added the lip color because I always feel like a neutral lip with a heavy eye look is like the best route to take so I did use my MAC Court Lip Liner along with Velvet Teddy by MAC because I feel like this is a perfect combination and then on top of that I used Boy Bait which is a gloss by MAC as well just to bring the lips all together and this is the final look. Okay. 
Okay guys, so that is the end of this tutorial. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Like, this was really, really nice for my first time doing a nice smoky eye look that actually included color. If you guys like these types of videos, make sure you always give it a thumbs up because it does help me out. And if you have any suggestions of other makeup videos that you are interested in me filming, then always leave those in the comment section below. And if you are not a subscriber, then go ahead and click that subscribe button and join the family. And until next time, I will see you guys later. Bye.